So what's the deal with the with with um with June bugs, Katie Lynn? I, I gotta know. I don't know, man. It's just cicadas. You know, they're green. Green's a pretty color, aren't right? And they're kind of like a greenish color. You know, they got little. They don't look creepy. They just don't look as creepy as June bugs. June bugs, their little leg. Eh, uh uh, get away from here. And they're always like. That's the problem. Cicadas, you don't hear about cicadas flying your hair all up in your clothes or some crap like that. You hear about that with June bugs. June bugs. June bugs are always going after people. I don't know. Well, I mean, that. not only that, but June <laughs> bugs are always extremely early, right? They usually come out in March, and that's not fair. Like, we're supposed to be only worried about these guys in June, and they're oh, here okay. from March to September, and that doesn't, that doesn't seem fair to me. No. Nope. Not to mention, I think I think the thing that bothers me the most about June bugs is they are suicidal. <laughs> you mean, right, they are they are extremely suicidal. Like they can't leave you alone, and it's like their curiosity involves like hitting your forehead as in a, with as much speed poking as possible. Bear. Yeah, right? poking the bear. Yeah. Like, and uh, they hit you so hard, it's like these little bastards have football helmets on, you know? No, it actually hurts. Yeah. It does. And then if you have hair, God forbid, these uh, little, like, they have, like... They're little things? Yes! Like, they get stuck in your hair, and then they're, they're trying to fly out, and, like, no. You can't get it out. Even if you're, like, pulling on it, it's like, mm -hmm. no. Oh. Yeah. No. They have gorilla glue on their on their appendages. Yeah. And and that gorilla glue only works on human hair. I'm here to tell you. Cuz they don't get stuck on anything else. I wonder how like uh every other animal in the animal kingdom feels about June bugs or like the insect kingdom too. I wonder They're, how they all feel. Like uh, is he the outcast? I don't know. But I mean Like do we do we all hate the June bug? Well, my question is, and this is another <laughs> one that maybe somebody out there can answer, right? So in the Northern Hemisphere, where Katie and I live, it is summer during the summer, right? It's the, like the summer months are like June, July, August, right? But then in the Southern Hemisphere, the, the summer months are flipped. Mm -hmm. So like summer in Australia, for example, is like December, January, and February. That's so bizarre. So do the, my question is, do the June bugs have a different name down there? Like, are they November bugs? Like, in, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, November bugs. They God damn, why be November bugs? And, God, that was a horrible Australian accent. But They the would come out in November instead of December, wouldn't they? Well, it would be, well, That'd June be is the like sixth them. month, so I guess it would probably be more December bug would be more accurate. But they I'm out not, for two months. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe we should just take the month bug. off of there and just call them Bug. <laughs> like they're just like the Prince of Bugs, the Bug, the, bug. the <laughs> bug formerly known as the June Bug. That's All a right. movie. <laughs> All right, bug. so we did talk about the periodical cicadas. This is no. not a um, like grunge bluegrass band. This is. A real thing. You guys should check it out. Again, uh, they're basically just cicadas that live underground until they're adults. Then they're blown out into the world like bats from a cave because they're adults. And they're enjoy. It's like, you know, graduating from college. And then they're out in the world. And then they die, like, immediately. <laughs> and now they're just feeding in... Natural in selection. Right. It's like their whole life is underground eating tree sap and plant sap. And then they're, they finally get out into the world and they're so excited. Imagine if that's the way it was, right? Like you just finally get out of your parents' care and now you're just dead. Uh, 